Hi guys, it's Ingrid with Spot Treasures. I'm back today to make a custom soap called Clarity. I made this soap last year for the month of January for Cervical Cancer Awareness Month, and I donated all the proceeds to the uh, Cervical Cancer Foundation. Um, but someone had asked me to make another batch of it, so I am. If they don't purchase it all, I will put the remaining bars on the website. So it has peppermint essential oil in it and eucalyptus essential oil in it. And just maybe a little bit, half an ounce of regular peppermint fragrance. And that's it. So I've already added all of my clays and milk powders and all that good stuff. And oatmeal to my colloidal oatmeal. So let's get started. I'm going to go ahead and add my lye water. I have a bath bomb called Clarity, and it has the same scents in it, peppermint essential oil and eucalyptus essential oil as well. I'm not really sure how the essential oil is going to do with this new recipe of mine. So I'm going to use the, uh, I'm sorry, I'm going to put the fragrance in last. When I looked at my notes, I had since changed the recipe from when I made it last year, so. Put that right there. Okay, I didn't do too much blending, just enough to um, get it all emulsified and then I'll blend more as I add the colors in. And I'm being very optimistic in doing a four color drop swirl. So let me put this right here. That's for the white. I don't need that much of that. in here. I get a few custom soap requests every now and then. And normally, if I can fit them into my schedule, I will do them. Okay. So, let me see here. Just a little bit there. Okay, that should be good. So, I'm going to start with the white. just a little wider.
scrape down all the sides. Okay, I can tell you this peppermint and this eucalyptus smells so good. Okay, so let's go with the next blue and this is called a preppy blue and it actually looks like it has gold mica or something in it. it I don't know if you can really see it, but it looks like it has some type of gold in it. So I'm dying to see how this is going to turn out. Oh, now that is pretty. I don't know if you can see the gold shimmer in that or not, but it's really pretty. Alright, so I'm really don't need to stick on this one. So, let's see. All right, that looks good. Let's do this blue. I think this one is called, no, that other one is called bling blue. This one is called prep, preppy blue. This more this looks more like a denim kind of sort. It's pretty. Yeah, this is really pretty. what this one was called. I think it's called Blue Moon, if I'm not mistaken. So this worked out pretty well, and I didn't really need to do much stick blending, so that worked out pretty good. So let me clear up my mess and get my soap mold. And I've got four spatulas, so I don't need this one. All right, so let me go ahead and add the fragrance in them. Said, let me add the fragrance, but it's actually an essential oil fragrance blend.
this blue, this preppy blue is really interesting. It's it's a different weird blue, but it's got such a gold shimmer in it. It's really pretty. Now my white is getting thick. So let me try to stir this down, get it loose again. So this is mainly blue, as you can see, with a little bit of white in it. So I'm going to start here. Let me get another paper towel for my spatulas. Okay. So let's Been a while since I've done a four color drop sorrel.
the last bit of this out. Smelling this is making me want to go get one of my Clarity bath bombs. Hold on, guys. Okay, guys, sorry, I had to answer the phone. hoping to get more than one batch done today but that didn't happen Let's finish with the white. Which has gotten very thick. wants to call when you're soaping. Okay. okay. So I'm gonna use the thicker end of the skewer since the soap is a little thicker.
Okay guys, so I did not bring any glitter upstairs, so there's no glitter on this. So this is Clarity in the mold. It'll probably be ready, I would say the first week of May, probably the last week of April. Um, let me see if I can zoom in for you. Okay, there it is. So thank you guys for watching, and I will attach the cutting video to the back half of this one. Thanks a lot. Bye. Hi guys, it's Ingrid. I'm back today to cut the Clarity soap that I made yesterday. It's a custom soap. It has um, peppermint essential oil and a little bit of peppermint fragrance oil and eucalyptus essential oil. So it's really an essential oil blend. So let's get to cutting and see what it looks like. And this was actually a four color drop swirl that I did. It was three different blues and a white. That came out really pretty. And this batch is a custom batch for um, a customer and they want the whole batch. I was thinking that they might not want the whole thing and I was gonna put a few bars on the website, but they want the whole batch. So I will probably make another batch to put onto the website as a limited edition. Smells really good. You can smell the peppermint more than the eucalyptus, but the blend of them both together is a really nice scent. I have, as I, I might have mentioned when I was making the soap, that I have a bath bomb that's clarity that has the same scents in it as well. It got a little thick on me, the white did, but it looks like it blended pretty well. So this is the final. So um, I probably will not get this on the website. I thought I would, but I'm probably not going to because they're going to purchase the whole batch. So I'll probably try to make another batch of it within the next couple of weeks and get that out on the website. So thanks for watching and have a great day.